Okay, here's Prince of Egypt by DreamWorks. This is the very last scene in the movie. They've already crossed the Red Sea. This is Moses and his wife Zipporah. And behind them is Mount Sinai. And he's about to bring the Ten Commandments down. Here we see it's actually written in correct ancient Hebrew. They call it Paleo Hebrew, but the actual name was Yahudi. And this is completely true and correct, even down to these little markers. You see these little dots that show up like in between the words? That's like a space. It just separates one word from the other. I never really see anybody ever talk about those, but that's how it originally was. And right here, this says, you know, because you will read it from right to left. This is a lamed and an aleph, so it'd be la. This is the Hebrew word for no. So this says, no murder, no adultery, no steal. This is the original way that the Ten Commandments was actually written. It didn't say you do not steal or you do not do this it just says no this no this and uh, not a lot of people really know that but i have watched this movie a million and one times i loved this as a child it's one of my favorite movies i have the whole thing memorized and only two years ago did I catch this and i just was flipping out i said oh man they whoever put this in this movie really knew what they were doing this is the most accurate i've i've like ever seen right here sorry about that cecil b demille's ten commandments check that out there's moses and again the yahudi on the ten commandments not latin not pictograph not English, the original language that's documented. There are artifacts of Hebrew works, biblical stories that are written in this language. But see, look, this one's missing the little markers in between the words. It's just absolutely incredible. There have been people that have known this for so long. Look at that. People have known about this and we're only just now finding out about it. Incredible.